This instructional video will demonstrate how to set up your new Kyocera M5526 CDW multifunctional printer. Open the box and locate the bag that contains the manuals and DVD. This machine weighs 60 pounds, so be careful when lifting the machine out of the box. It is recommended that two people lift the printer out of the box. Place the machine on a flat level surface. Open the right door by pressing this latch and swing the door to the rear. Remove the security tabs from each of the toner containers by pulling down and towards yourself. Pull this piece of tape and then remove the cardboard. Close the right side cover. Plug the power cord into the back of the printer. Power on the printer by pressing the power button found on the lower right front of the machine. Allow the machine to run its startup sequence. This may take up to six minutes to complete, so please be patient. The machine will then prompt you to select a language. The default is English. Press on the next key. The next screen asks, is this device managed by administrator? Yes, medium or large offices, or no, a small or home office. Answering yes to this question will require you to use a name and password to get into some functions of the machine. Answering no does not require a login and password. If you're the only user of this machine or are in a home office environment, it's recommended to answer no to this question. Make your selection. The machine will advance to the next screen. You will now enter the machine setup wizard, which will take you through a series of steps to set up your new machine. The first step is date and time. Press next to begin. Scroll to select your local time zone, Summer time appears. If you live in a region which employs daylight saving time, select on, otherwise select off. Press next. The screen will advance to the date. Make appropriate changes as needed. Date and time are usually programmed at the factory. Press next. The next screen is time. Make changes as needed. Press next. Network setup appears. Please select between Wi-Fi for wireless setup or wired, meaning a patch cable must be plugged into the machine and to your router, switch, or access point. If the printer is to be connected to your network using wireless, view the M5526 wireless setup video. You can also find this procedure in the M5526 CDW operation guide. If you're connecting the printer to a network cable, Please view the M5526 Network Cable Setup video. You can also find this procedure in the M5526 CDW Operation Guide. To learn how to connect the printer to a computer with a USB cable, please watch the M5526 USB Cable Setup video. You can also find this procedure in the M5526 CDW Operation Guide. If you're at an altitude of 3,280 feet or higher, you must set the machine's altitude setting. This setting must be adjusted in order to maintain the quality of the prints. The steps for this adjustment are in the M5526 Adjusting Altitude video. You can also find this adjustment in the M5526 CDW Operation Guide. Now it is time to connect the printer to the network or directly to a computer.